Oh, shit. Oh. 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 All right. Well, they uh, pushed my sleeve surgery back by a couple days. So I had a little extra time. And went and got this junky little junky little uh, outboard to work on again. I'll be working on that soon, but that is not what I'm excited about. This, this is what I'm excited about. Whoa, a mobility scooter. Yeah, so when I went to get the outboard, it was at a mobility scooter place, which was confusing when I pulled up. The guy probably should have mentioned that, but uh, yeah, so pick that up, no problem, I'll take it. And this was out by the dumpster like just like this um and this is anyways i asked him if i could take it he said go ahead so i loaded it up uh it did not work on the bottom underneath i don't feel like taking all the wires out of it right now the the wires were totally cut uh, the whole thick harness of wires cut all the way through in two spots i ended up finding out because at one point i tried to i rewired every single wire back um and i still wasn't getting anything and then i found out it was cut in another spot like damn all these bundles of wires are cut so but this is this is days later now now i've had my surgery it's about a week after my surgery now so it's been a little while so i i have put a little bit of work into it you can't really see what i did i, I don't feel like lifting the floor up right this moment but um so basically what i believe bad is this little controller I think it's bad something's bad with it I don't know I think that's why the wires were cut to begin with um, this is a uh, this is the original like throttle to it we call the wig wag controller which normally went right inside there but so what I did is I took and put a I already had a like an e-bike controller from when, from when I, just like that, same thing, 500 watt, 24 volt, uh, I bought an extra one from when I converted Tegan's Jeep, because I was going to run 500 watts on front motors and, and 500 watts on back motors for 1000 watts, uh, but I never installed the other one, this thing runs pretty good on just 500 watts. So I had an extra, and so I put it in here, and I ordered this little thumb throttle here. Um, so that's all I did is I got rid of the original controller, and I uh, um, yeah, put all the wires together, put me in a little e-bike controller, and that's the battery out of that I usually use for Tegan's um, Jeep. It's 24 volt, but uh, it's pretty good. I got it working now. None of the other stuff is hooked up at the moment. I just hooked this all up real quick just to see if it worked. But uh, I don't know. What do you think? Oh, shit. <laughs> it doesn't have any brakes at the moment. Um, but yeah, it's pretty fast. It's pretty fast. And yes, it does work. Yeah, he screams. Come on. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, watch out, Ellie. Coming through. Oh, boy. Oh. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, man. Whoa. Oh, okay. Oh, I gotta turn that around. So, okay, that little controller, it's like, what, 30 bucks or something? And, uh, this little throttle is like 10 bucks. But now, I don't know what to do with this. Oh, and I actually ordered the key too, um, because I didn't have a key. So now I have the key and you know none of this stuff is even hooked up anymore, but I don't know what to do with this thing because I can't really sell it to an old person as a mobility scooter because it's like, oh, it'll do a freaking wheelie on them. 
that and it, and it does do a wheelie um i don't know i don't really know what to do with it besides play is basically real life Mario Kart. Going to do some hot laps with this mobility scooter. Ready, Mark? Get set. Go! Stop it right there. <laughs>